they're racers, so they always push the limits. If I say I'm not nervous, uh, would be like. I remember being at the top of the hill and thinking like, why are you doing this? To stay not injured is something I'm thinking about for sure. We don't have any more time left to really try, so everything has to be fast now and just be ready for the races. My name is Marlene. I'm the team manager for the both Gaskas teams. So it's Gaskas Motor X Racing and Gaskas SRAM Racing for the 2023 EDRE racing season. For the season, I want the team to be a team. So I want us to be a family. I want us to help out each other if there is help needed. Buongiorno per la mattina. No, mattina. Are you ready? Can I see the bike? Yes. <laughs> in the end, we want to have a good time together as well. well your system in the box. Well, my name is Alex Marin. I'm 26 years old now. And uh, yeah, I'm a rider for Gas Gas's Ram team. Oh my God. <laughs> An exciting year for us, having a new bike, uh, a new team, and for me, for myself, it will be a new chapter too, because I've never been involved in the e-bike industry and Dura World Series, so everything is really new, but uh, it feels like home. Here right now, having the team camp in Finale Ligure, you really see the team connecting, like really connecting. Yeah. Hello! Hello! I'm Johannes Fischbach. I'm a rider for the Gas Gas SRAM team. We just got a new bike, a complete new prototype. I'm super excited to ride it, to test it, to spend a lot of hours on it now. So my name is Simon Carlson. I'm living in Sweden, in a town called Falun, and I'm racing for Gas Gas Motor X Racing. I think me and the whole uh, team has a lot of work to do, but I really feel that everybody pushing what we can and I think like with just time we will get there. So I'm Alexander Fayol. I'm from France in the south to be with Gas Gas now with a new prototype, new people, new, new everything and just ready to ride. My name is uh, Daniel Swanbeck, I'm from Sweden and my role will be technical manager. So we will work alongside Marlene and help riders with, uh, with everything they need in the pit during the races. This year is going to be a development season. We are racing on a prototype. We are supporting development, not just from the frame development, but also from the suspension development. We are super close with our internal partner WP for the suspension for the Gas Gas Motor X racing team. But we are also in a super close relationship with SRAM for the Gas Gas SRAM, obviously, racing team. Do you not want to hear the story? So I had some, like, honestly, I had a, like a really shitty winter, it's like both mentally and physically, physically. So then, uh, like, vamos is the kind of go-to word for, especially Spain, Spain, but also for gas gas. So that's why I printed in and like to myself, like, let's go. It's a new chapter. Um, it's been good, um, and I think we will be ready. We just need like a couple races under the belt just to see how it is and see where we are and then just go from there. But I will try just to put the bike at its maximum here and just try to put the proper like good setup and we'll be good from there. Yeah. <laughs> if you just look at it, it looks like the perfect e-bike like in the shapes, the colors, for sure a dream bike. Our race bike looks insane, to be honest. It's so cool and everybody loves it. 
so it's maybe one of the coolest bikes we've ever had in our portfolio. Today's mission is to continue work on the suspension and try out the engine on some power stage training. It's a new bike, so we have to test a lot and we not have that much time until the first races. Um, first of all, I want to have fun and then, of course, we want to perform good. <laughs> I'm just learning some bleeding tips <laughs> from the master, yeah, 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 Master Nico. Hi, I'm Nico. I'm from SRAM and the Race Tech. And we're here in Nice Final Ligure for the first test camp with the Gas Gas team. And yeah, we try to make everyone happy on the bike, not even just like on the power drain side, also like suspension, brakes, everything around the bike. We prepping a fork for you. Okay. Like a different charger. A full fork or just uh, uh, setting on this one? A different charger. Ah, okay. A new charger. Okay, okay. okay. Shut up in the motor. Some uh, tip on how Try the fork. Good. No, it's pretty smooth. Yeah, it's a bit of challenging because everything is new, new, new sports. Because downhill and e-bike, it's really completely different. There is no, I mean, it's kind of bicycle, but everything is different. I mean, it's pretty simple. You just have to ride track you don't know and go as fast as you can. <laughs> so. <laughs> To stay, stay not injured is something I'm thinking about for sure. Oh, that, that, yeah. not so much. In the last few years, there's been so many hard crashes, and I don't want any of my boys to be in that situation. What happened to you? Uh, crash. Um, how does it feel? Does it doesn't it hurt that much. Yeah. This one. So it was dislocated and then yeah, you put it back. Yeah, put it back, yeah. Oh. Shit happens. I'm always, like, I'm a nervous person, so I'm always a bit nervous. <laughs> if I say I'm not nervous, it uh, would be a lie. So there is a lot of uh, different things now. It's a uh, new racing, it's an official World Cup, it's... Yeah, everything is more or less new for me, so of course I'm nervous. <laughs> I mean, if you really care about this career, you need to have nerves. For my side, um, I have a routine, I have a psychologist, which helps me quite a lot. And um, I think with the experience and with the ups and downs, it, like every year I feel like I mature even more and I know how to manage those nerves a little bit. We are getting ready now to go for a loop. It's a good first uh, training to see how the bike um, goes in like all the stages and poor staging or see. Big loop, they told me. I'm ready for sure. Look at the weather, no wind. So for me, we can go eight hours on the bike, I don't care. That was long. Uh -huh. 
45 minutes ago we was like we was we not found a way pedaling everywhere it was maxed out but good for me personally i'm nervous about not being prepared in terms of i missed something important if any of the riders is crashing and um it's not just a crash if it's something more that's what i'm nervous about because they're racers so they always push the limits but this is something i might be also scared not i might be i am scared because i care about the boys so that's it <laughs>